These are the materials and tools you need when cutting and sanding copper pipes and sheets. Before cutting a copper pipe, measure the required length using a folding ruler. Mark the point where you want to cut the pipe with an erasable marker pen. Now it's time to use the multifunction tool. Select the segment saw blade for metal and attach it to the device. Put on ear defenders, a face mask, safety goggles and work gloves before cutting the copper pipe. To make sure the pipe doesn't slip, secure it before cutting. Now you can cut the pipe at the spot you have marked. The copper pipe is now finished. If you want to sand down and smoothen these sawn off edges, use blue sanding paper for metal with fine grit, for example 240. You can sand down larger areas using a sanding block. It's best to sand down edges and corners by hand. Since copper is very soft, be careful when sanding. Before you continue, clean the pipe using acetone or metal polish. Once you finish sanding and cleaning, the pipe is ready to use in your projects. Before cutting the copper sheet, measure out and mark the dimensions using a marker pen. Now you can cut the copper sheet to size using plate shears. Your copper sheet is cut to size and ready to use.